Good morning, boys and girls. This is Miss Mendes again for today's morning message. Boys and girls, do you remember when we did a unit about heroes and helpers? Yeah. Can you name me some of them? Yeah, you're right. Doctors, nurses, police officers, firefighters, yeah, teachers, mm -hmm. yeah, grocery store workers. You're right, and a lot, lot more. But guess what, boys and girls? There are plenty of brave heroes and helpers out there right now working so hard to make sure that we are all safe and healthy. Today, I would like to write them a letter to thank them for all that they do. Will you help me write a letter today, friends? Boys and girls, when we write a letter, it's important that we put a date on it. Can you tell me why it's important to put a date on our letters? You're right! So that we will remember when we wrote that letter. Well, today's date is April 13, 2020. Let's write, let's write today's date right about here. Are you ready? When I say the word April, I hear what sound at the beginning? Yeah, A, A, A. Good job. What letter makes that sound? The letter A. Well, is the A sound the long A sound or the short A sound? You're right. It's the long A sound. A, A, A. Do you remember the short A sound? Yeah! Ah, ah, ah! Good job! So, let me write today's date now. It's A, A, April, space. Do you remember how to write number 13? Yeah! One and three. Thirteen. One and three. Good job. I'm going to put a slow comma right after the number 13. And let's see if we can name me these numbers. What's that number? Two. You're right. What's that number? Zero. What's that number? Two. And what's that number? Yeah, zero. So today's day is April 13, 2020. Good job, friends. Now, I am writing this letter to the brave heroes and helpers out there. So, I'm going to say... Right about here, I want to say dear. I want to write the word dear. Can you help me write the word dear? Yeah, what sound do we hear at the beginning of dear? D, D, D. What letter makes that sound? You're right. Today, I'm going to write A. Well, can you tell me if it's the uppercase D or the lowercase D? Yes, it is the uppercase D. Good job. So, D, dear. What sound do we hear at the end of dear? What letter makes that sound? R, you're right. Dear. 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 The boys and girls, do you remember who were writing the letter to? Yes, we're writing our letter to the brave heroes and helpers out there who are working so hard to make sure that we are all safe and healthy. So we say, dear, space, yeah, heroes, <laughs> heroes, dear heroes. Now, 
Do you remember this punctuation mark? Yeah, a comma. That means I'm not done with my sentence yet. I'm just taking a really quick break. <laughs> Dear heroes. Yeah. Now, what do we want to say to our heroes? Yeah, we want to say thank you for all that you do. Can you help me write that sentence? Yeah, well, let's see how many words are in that sentence. Thank you for all that you do. How many words are in that sentence? Seven, you're right. Our sentence for today has seven words. Good job. We said our first word is think. Let's write that word right about here. Here we go. Think. Think. And that's all of the letters in the word think. So I'm going to put my finger space right after that. Thank you. Do you remember how to spell you? That's one of our power words. Yeah. Y O U U. <laughs> y O U U. Good job. Thank you. Space. What's our next word? You're right. Four. And that's another power word. Do you remember how to spell it? You're right. F O R four. Let's write that word. F O R four. Good job, guys. Thank you for. What's our next word? Oh, good job. Ah, I don't see any more room right after the word four. So you remember where we go next? Yeah, down here. Good job, friends. Ooh, what was our word again? Oh, that's another power word. Can you spell it for me? A L L. Oh, let's write it together. A L L. All. Thank you for all space. What's our next word? That. You're right. Let's see if we can write that word. That. That. Thank you for all that space. What's our next word? Yeah, you. You already know how to spell the word you. It's right up here. Mm -hmm. Let's spell it together. Here we go. I said write it. Y O U U. Good job. Thank you for all that you space. And what's our last word? Do. And that's another power word. Do you remember how to spell it? Yeah. D O Do. Let's write that. D all do and that's the last word in our sentence so we need a punctuation mark what's a good punctuation mark for this sentence let's read it one more time thank you for all that you do are we asking a question no <laughs> are we so excited did i say thank you for No, uh -uh. so not an exclamation point. Hmm, let me try a period. Let's see. If, if I put a period right here, my sentence would sound like this. Thank you for all that you do. Do you like that better? Yeah, so I think a period at the end is the best punctuation right to put to end our sentence with. Good job, guys. 
And that's it! We just wrote our message. Now we are ready to close our letter. Today, I want to write the word love. Because I love our, all our heroes and helpers. Now, most of you can already spell the word the, the word love. Can you help me spell it? What sound do you hear at the end, beginning of love? You're right. Oh. Can you tell me if it's an uppercase L or a lowercase L? Yeah, it's the uppercase L. Oh. I know how to spell love because I always write it. There you go. Love. Love. And what punctuation mark is that again? A comma. Love. Who are we, friends? The pre-K friends. So we say love. Pre-K. Ta-da! We just wrote a letter for our special heroes and helpers. Let's see if we can read our letter one more time. Are you ready? Now, as a reminder, when we read or write, we always start from the top, right here. So let's read it together. April 13, 2020. Dear heroes, thank you for all that you do. Love, Pre-K. How does that sound? Do you like how it sounds? Me too! I think we just wrote a perfect letter for our heroes and helpers. Now boys and girls, our letter has five important parts. This part right here is the date. Can you say the word date? Yeah, date. I'm going to put the date part in a nice box just like that. The date. This part right here is the greeting. Can you say greeting? Good job! This is the greeting part. Good job! And this part right here is the body. Can you say body? Yeah! This is the body of our letter. This is where we write our message. Good job, guys! And this part right here is the closing. Can you say closing? Closing. Good job. That's the closing part. And this part right here is the signature part. Can you say signature? Yeah, this is where we write our names. We said pre-K because the pre-K friends wrote this letter. Good job, boys and girls. It sounds like you are ready to write your own letter. Go ahead, grab those pencils and papers and markers and crayons and write a letter. Practice writing a letter to somebody. Bye. Be safe, everyone. We love you.